Tomorrow is communion service. Hey, everybody, just preparing. Hallelujah. Praying here in the sanctuary. Tomorrow, getting the sanctuary ready for tomorrow. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Believing that even as people are preparing to come to this sanctuary tomorrow, praise God that the presence of God will be for you, will meet you here. Hallelujah. That this is going to be a powerful service on tomorrow. Thank you, Jesus. Even as we come to the to the house, Father, I bless these chairs. As people are going to sit in these chairs, or people are coming, Father, with prayer, prayer requests. People are coming. I anoint everything. I anoint all of our equipment in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, whoever is going to sit in these chairs, whoever is going to sit in these chairs, God, whatever their needs are, whatever their situations are, I release the anointing. I release the anointing. I release the blessings of the Lord. I release it upon every person that comes through this door. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh God, let your oil be upon this altar. Let the fire on this altar never go out. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Lord God, as we're preparing this sanctuary, as we're preparing this house, as we're preparing this place, as people are coming from the east, west, north, and south of the earth, wherever they're coming from, wherever they're coming from, expecting, oh God, a miracle from you, expecting to be touched by you. In the name of Jesus. Anoint from the front to the back. In the name of Jesus Christ, anoint from the top to the bottom. Oh God, let your oil, as they come through these doors, as they come through these doors, Father, I thank you. I declare your blood, the blood of Jesus over the doors. As they put their feet over the threshold of this building, as they come through this walkway, as they come through the hallways, Father, let it be that every life will be changed and not one of them will be the same again. I anoint the doorposts in the name of Jesus. I anoint it in the name of Jesus. God bless you. You good? Bless you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Rabba Baba Kashata. Rabba Karaba Sanda. Rabba Kalaba Shoto. In the name of Jesus. Lord, however they come in this building, wherever they're coming from tomorrow. Oh my God. Father, I want you to release an anointing upon this water. Lord, that this water will become different. Whatever they need it to be, whether they need it to be uh, a water for healing, a water, praise God, for deliverance or anointed, let it be upon the water. My God, in the name of Jesus Christ, God, I'm expecting miracles, signs, and wonders. Bless these altars, Lord. You said, give these altars to the people. Bless the oil. Father, let the anointing be upon the oil. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Oh God. We saw the oil. We saw the oil. We saw the oil pouring in our sanctuary. And God, we expect it to pour even more. In the mighty name of Jesus, we expect it to pour even more. Hallelujah. Bless everything in this place. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. We dedicate it to you, Lord. We dedicate it to you. We dedicate it to you. I dedicate it to you. I dedicate everything to the Lord. Even the prayer shawls, I dedicate them to you. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let people wear these comments. Let their prayers be answered. Let their prayers be heard. 
in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus. Maradalamasa, bless everything in this bookstore. Bless everything, oh God. Everything that, that you've given, oh God, to us, we give it to the people. In the mighty name of Jesus, as they enter reservations, as they come through the doors to register, as they're standing here, let them experience your fire. Let them experience your power. In the mighty name of Jesus, Oh God, Ramanda Rebosha, Randalaba Shata, every area, every aspect of this building, from the front to the back. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, Robo Shata Rabasate, I declare your blood over the doorways. I declare your blood over the threshold. Father, let your presence, let your presence be felt. Let them experience an encounter. Your presence, your power, in a mighty way. In a mighty way. Hallelujah. I don't know who's coming through these doors tomorrow. Praise God. I don't know what's going to draw you to this church. I don't know what's going to draw you to believers' faith. But amen. As a servant of God, I just, I've been on this altar now for several days. Praise God. After coming out of the Bahamas and coming out of the revival in the Bahamas, I dropped my bags home and I I just heard the Spirit of the Lord says, come and meet me on this altar. And I've been here on the altar now, praise God, since coming back from the Bahamas. And I've just been praying and interceding from so many of you because I know that so many of you are going through and you're believing God for miracles. You're believing God for, 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 for just for healing, for deliverance, for breakthrough in your life and so this way I've been as you come tomorrow as you come this week if, as you come praise God come in faith come with confidence knowing that the spirit of God is going to meet you here knowing that the spirit of God is going to bless you I believe when you cross over the threshold the power of God is going to hit you and I believe that your life is going to be transformed forever and ever and ever. Praise God. I just wanted to pray for you today. And I bless this house. I bless this house. I bless this house. I bless Believers Faith Outreach Ministries. Jesus said his house should be called the house of prayer. And I believe that this is a praying house, that this is a praying altar. And everything that concerns you, it is blessed. It is blessed. It is blessed in the name of Jesus. I don't know who's going to sit in these chairs tomorrow. Shabakala makala bashata. I just wanted to come back in here again and pray just one more time. I don't know who's going to sit in this chair right here tomorrow. But I'm believing God that whoever it is that will get to sit in this chair, that will get to sit in this chair. Jitalabakala bashata. Something used to happen back in the day. Like we would see like the chairs covered in glitter and um, covered in just precious stones. And those were the days where we would see like the the oil falling, the diamond falling, the just, you know, different miracles, different things happening and we're beginning to see those supernatural things happening again thank you Jesus so I just wanted to take the time to pray and Apostle and I we do this regularly where we pray for the people coming people coming believing that as you come that God will meet you at the point of your need he'll meet you at the point of your miracle Father, I release the oil of the anointing upon this altar. I release the power of the Holy Spirit to move miracles, signs, and wonders. And that people will be healed, delivered, and set free by the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name, God bless you guys. God bless you guys. 
But God bless you guys. Love you all. I'll see y'all. I'll see y'all. Just wanted to come in and pray for a minute. <laughs> yes, thank you guys. Thank you guys. Love you all. Love you too. Amen. God bless you.